our Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina wrote to the, His Excellency President of Argentina congratulating his team for the emphatic win and lifting the World Cup. And immediately after that, there was a very positive response received from the President of Argentina, His Excellency the President. And there were hints, there were hopes that we will, and there were resolve that we will make the relationship and probably we will work together to reopening the embassy. And I congratulate the Foreign Minister, Mrs. Santiago, because when he met uh, our Foreign Minister uh, about almost a year ago, they talked about bilateral relationship, how to strengthen it further. And as you can imagine, by 2023, at the very first month, Bangladesh listed by IMF as the 35th largest economy. With its growing importance, it has attracted Argentina from the power of land in Latin America as well. And there were immediate commitment from the government of Argentina for reopening the mission. And we are here today. And I think this is one of a greatest examples that how people can inspire respective governments in establishing political, diplomatic, and economic ties. And in almost no time, both the foreign offices work really closely here and Buenos Aires, and also from Delhi. And today, on 27th of February, not within a few minutes. A todas las autoridades de aquí de Bangladesh y a todo el pueblo de Bangladesh por hacer posible en tiempo tan corto poner en funcionamiento una vez más esta embajada. Thank you very much, everyone. Um, thank you uh, for this journey. Thank you for the people and the courage of the Senate for uh, letting us reopen the Senate in the second quarter of the term. La historia de nuestros pueblos arranca mucho antes, mucho antes incluso se reconocieran las relaciones diplomáticas entre ambos pueblos. Ese tiempo arrancó en momentos donde el premio Nobel, Tabore, visitaba la Argentina, generaba un vínculo con una especial artista argentina, Victoria. This is because uh, the people never forgot. The people of Bangladesh never forgot. And decided to show the world its love for Argentina. And that is why uh, today we humbly come to carry out this act of justice and reopen the embassy of Argentina as a new channel to continue to cement our relations. Por supuesto que estarán las relaciones comerciales, por supuesto que estarán las relaciones económicas que, que podamos construir, que podamos consolidar y agrandar. De hecho, durante esta visita me acompañan 20 empresarios argentinos que están con una gran cantidad de reuniones durante el día de hoy y el día de mañana. Of course, there will be trade relations, economic relations that we will need to build and extend. In fact, I'm uh, being accompanied this day by 20 arts and business persons that will be holding meetings today and tomorrow. Pero lo que nos mantuvo vivo durante este tiempo, lo que, mantuvo, lo que mantuvo vivo la relación entre Bangladesh y la Argentina fue la cultura, fue el deporte, fue el fútbol, fue Victorio Campo, fue haber sido uno de los primeros países que reconoció su independencia, 